What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Ace Attorney with an Actual Lawyer. I am your host, Zach. Join me once again is the voice actor, Wes. What's up? And the actual lawyer, Pridge. Actually napped and ready to lawyer. <laughs> uh, if this is your first time tuning in, I don't know why you just started now. If you'd like to watch the episode live, we do it, We do host it on our Twitch as well, which there'll be a link to in the description down below. Uh, but no worries not, we post the edited version on our YouTube every following Monday. All right, let's get into it. Let's get investigating. <laughs> Whew, what a day. This is no time for relaxing, Zach. <sighs> I mean, Nick. <laughs> Say, you think WP's got a chance? I guess that really depends on the people we found out about in today's trial. Also depends on you, Phoenix, right? <laughs> <laughs> the director and the producer. Yeah, them. <laughs> well, what are we doing here then? Let's get to the studios. All right, let's go to the studio. No one's here. Right. Now that they have Miss Oldbag in custody. God damn, I do damn feel bad that she's locked in custody. Her up. <laughs> they got an old lady locked in jail. I do feel bad about that. I guess they don't have anyone else to replace her. Hey, in the guard station. Look, she left her donuts. <laughs> what? I wasn't going to eat them. <laughs> Objection. Uh, Lie. I just want to see if we can look at <laughs> Perjury. <laughs> you were studio. absolutely going to eat them, Maya. Uh, really quick, we do have a, a lawyer question in the chat. Jason says, I need some help with my D&D game. Does squatter's rights, specifically gaining ownership of the property when the owner no longer visits it after a set amount of time, apply to ghosts? <laughs> 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 I like that I read that in real time, so the, the twist didn't hit me until I read Apply to Ghosts. Uh... <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Actual lawyer question. So, most likely not, um, given that usually for, um, usually for squatters' rights to apply, the, uh, the, the ownership has to be open and adverse. And ghosts are invisible. Mm. So their squatting on the premise wouldn't be open and adverse. Unless the person who owned the property can see ghosts and was aware that there is a ghost squatting oh. there. Then maybe. But ghosts, <laughs> the, the natural invisibility of ghosts often presents the uh, the disputed ownership from being open. God damn. Uh, somebody clipped that. That was an excellent, <laughs> excellent assessment, Fridge. Thank you. Who you Hey, who are you going to call? Michael Pridge. <laughs> <laughs> also, just, just, in case, just so everyone can know, the actual legal term for squatter's rights is adverse possession. Huh. Ooh. I, th I, I mean, personally, I like squatter's rights a lot more. I don't, know, adverse, nice I don't know. I think adverse possession sounds kind of cool. Now, here's the thing. Adverse possession, a ghost possessing the property. <laughs> Sounds pretty uh, adverse like to a, me. We got like a poltergeist situation. Going yeah, on. yeah. Jason, if that didn't answer your question, I don't know what will. <laughs> <laughs> your Honor, I rest my case. <laughs> uh, let's go to the employee area first. Yeah, sure. All right, all right. Look, it's that assistant girl. Hey! Hi. WP lawyers, right? I heard about the trial. Great job, guys. Oh? <laughs> Don't mention it. Oh, Phoenix, shut the <laughs> fuck up. <laughs> Is it true that they caught the security lady? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Actually, she just called me. <laughs> she told me to cover up that drain. You mean that one? The only yes, one? Yes, no, fucking drained in sight, <laughs> you idiot. Wow, what a mess. I... I know. 
I'm not so good with handiwork. So assistant, right? I, I do appreciate that Phoenix did again say that in his head. <laughs> but she just knew that he was judging her handiwork. Oh, I mean, it's he was pretty giving bad. Her the worst it's look. like four pieces of tape <laughs> awkwardly like yeah, but do you work on the props in the backdrop? Well, or yeah, but you were you do work on the props in the backdrops, right? Right. Just lots of times they end up looking worse than they did before I fixed them. <laughs> oh, oh. Well, I'm sure these things happen. Nothing to worry yourself about. You're right. I won't. <laughs> Personally, I think she should worry at least a little bit more. Um, if you'll excuse me, I have to go to the guard station. I'm supposed to fill in for this old bag. Right! See you later, then! Good luck with your investigation. Hopefully I don't fuck this up. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, just examine her handiwork yeah. on the grade for, for, for funsies. So the fanboy they were talking about in the trial today, he came in through that drain? So it seems. I guess they covered it up in a hurry. Hey, hey, Nick. If that drain's covered, the boy won't be able to get in. Uh, yeah, I think that was the idea. I feel kind of sorry for him, though, don't you? What? You want to rip the grate off? Really, Nick? We can? <laughs> Whoa, she's serious? Uh oh. <laughs> no, don't leave it, my damn. <laughs> I I I'm curious what happens. I know. Part of me is like, oh, it'd be funny, but. I, I love the idea of like, like, you try to rip it open and Penny just walks back in, like, oh, by the way, what? What, what are you the doing? Fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it took me, it or, took or me it two open. hours to do that. Or you rip it open and Pennywise the Clown starts offering you balloons. <laughs> we all float down here, <laughs> Phoenix. <laughs> hey there, Georgie. <laughs> uh, do we have a? Do, what's the consensus? Are we leaving it? <laughs> I, I I think we should not. We, we I think shouldn't. we should not commit more crimes than we ought than we usually do during <sighs> these cases. That's fair. That's fair. Nah, I think we should leave it on. They only just repaired it. And if we take it off, that assistant will get yelled at by you know who, Voldemort. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Wow, I didn't expect her to take it that hard. Uh, yeah, I will say. Uh, spoilers, Pridge. And just because we're here, we will have to take it off. So, oh, I, let's let's just do it because we're here. Okay. All right. Fair Cause enough. Because later it it will do. We just won't be able to progress. Hmm. Well, I guess some things are just made to be broken. <laughs> like the law. <laughs> like my heart. <laughs> Yay! You know, Nick, you're pretty swell sometimes. <laughs> Apparently, I'm also from the 1960s. Sometimes? You're pretty swell there, Nick. <laughs> hi -ya! There. That should make the kids happy. The things we do. I, uh, I doubt nothing has changed in the dressing room, so let's move to outside Studio One. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, you look a little out of place. Wow, Dick. Wow, Dick. <laughs> it's the clothes, isn't it? I thought my camo vest might do the trick. Kind of an alternative guard fashion thing. Wait, wait where did Penny go? I can't see her. <laughs> <laughs> Bring Penny back. <laughs> oh, God, Penny. You won't believe it. Some strange girl was in the guards. Ah! <laughs> I feel like I feel like Penny is a total wallflower, or at least at least the canon Penny that you have now created. Oh yeah. 
Uh, uh, just curious if she her. says anything, because I feel like the game is going to make us run through dialogue options. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, these actually could be useful conversation points. So, how are the studios doing? There's police wandering around everywhere. It's terrible. They won't even let me clean up. Don't want me disturbing evidence. I haven't even cleaned up our lunch plates from the day of the murder. <laughs> You mean those plates with the steak bones left over in them by the employee area? Yeah, that's hard evidence. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can you believe it? <laughs> Do kids sneak in here a lot? Well... I don't think that there's many of them, but I do see one in particular a bunch. Always gawking at the sets or snapping pictures. You should see old Windbag's eyes flash when she sees him. She has a bit of trouble catching him, though. He's the gingerbread man. <laughs> I heard something at the trial today. They said that the director and producer were here the day of the murder. Oh, sorry. I was in the prop storage room, so I didn't see them. I guess they were here, though. The studio had seemed pretty eager to keep us quiet. So they were trying to protect the director? The director protector. Or the, pro <laughs> or the producer, really. The producer's our real star here. She saved these studios from the brink of disaster and kept them running. I don't think we'd still be in business if it weren't for that, for that producer. <laughs> the producer, huh? That we're just not ever gonna say a name, huh? Yeah. The producer slash seducer. Uh, outside studio one. <clears throat> now, who's it gonna be? We getting gumshoe again? Uh... Hey, Nick, it's me, Dick Gumshoe. <laughs> It looks like Detective Gumshoe isn't here today. You're right. He's probably up to his neck in paperwork after all the commotion at today's trial. Oh, Nick. Remember that Studio 2 we heard about at the trial today? It was down that path with the fallen tree, right? Yeah, I think that's what they said. Maybe the director and the rest of them are there today. Now's our chance, Nick. Let's check it out. I like that he doesn't even like chastise her. He's like, oh yeah, let's fucking go sightseeing on this. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this place is deserted. What was that noise? Like the probably serious the music. Probably the murderer. The serious music starts playing like it's a real fucking danger. It sounded like it came from inside the trailer. Someone must be inside. Hello? Maybe it's a ghost that's squatting there. <laughs> no answer. Pretty suspicious if you ask me, Nick. Let's go in. Weren't you just terrified a moment ago? <laughs> I'm not sure we should be barging in. Huh. It's locked. <laughs> I, I like what? that he checked the lock. He's like, we shouldn't be I doing know. this. We shouldn't be doing this. Hey, it's locked. <laughs> what? Don't we have a key? No, but there's probably one on the guard station at the main gate. What are we waiting for? Let's borrow it. <laughs> if they'll let us. Welp. <laughs> I mean... I guess we have to go back to the guard station. Yeah, this That's is fun. this is, this is is my, easily my least favorite part about this, this case, is how much moving there is. Uh, can we ask her weren't for you it? Guys, weren't you guys just here, like, two minutes ago? Uh, don't worry about it. Look the other, look the <laughs> okay. other way while we go through the guard desk. Hey, what are you- oh, okay. <laughs> security guard station. I can see the computer that runs the security cameras. Oh, please don't touch anything in there! The security lady would knock the stuffing out of me if she knew. You would commit but you actually don't. <laughs> Plot twist, I'm actually a animatronic Build-A-Bear. <laughs> uh, I really want the key to that trailer. 
Maybe next time. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess uh, I guess we I'm... can't get it. I forgot that the body is still like outlined here. Oh, I'm the ghost of Jack Hammer. Ooh. I mean, we do have an actual spirit medium here. <laughs> we do. I don't really want to be in here. Yeah, it is a murder scene. I want to go someplace else, Nick. Er, Nick? <sighs> you want to go let's to the go ice cream? A different, let's go to a different murder scene. This <laughs> you want to go to an ice cream store, Maya? <laughs> we, we kind of a job to do. I mean, we can go get some burgers. <laughs> <laughs> you like burgers, Maya? Dan says, bitch, you work at your sister's murder scene. <laughs> <laughs> That's a That's really good point. So fucking good. <laughs> it's literally the room over from where her sister got killed literally a month ago. Yeah, but I hated that bitch. <laughs> And that's I'm why glad I killed she's her. Dead. <laughs> yeah, that's why I killed her. Thanks for framing that other schmuck. <laughs> Maya's actually a fucking mastermind. Uh, she's like, you idiot. She wrote my name on the receipt. Like, come on. <laughs> go go in the go in the dressing room. The dressing room. Yeah, just check it. Because there's at least some. What? Oh, yes. <laughs> this fucking guy. <laughs> Love this. Okay. Oh, God. oh boy, I can't this even guy. deal with this. I for, at first, I thought it was Maya saying, what the fuck? And I was like, oh, what? <laughs> WTF? Who are you dudes, LMAO? Fucking, this was still when Leet Speak was a thing. Uh, we... Wait, you first. Who are you? This brings me back to Comic-Con. You look pretty suspicious to me. <laughs> Whatever, neighbors. Oh, uh, fucking Jason says this is Reddit incarnate. <laughs> <laughs> so, so uncomfortable with what I'm looking at. <laughs> How could you not know the great Sal Manella? Fuck, I forgot his name is Sal Manella. <laughs> <laughs> what a weird name to get. <laughs> I make delete shows. The Steel Samurai, mine. RTFC, read the film credits. Like the, he has to give like a, a, a an acronym for something that isn't a thing and then explain it. Oh God. The worst human. Really? You're the Salmonella? I'm so sorry. I just, you looked so sorry. No, no, quite all right, really. It's fine, Raffle. This face is maybe the most offensive face that we have seen oh. in this entire game. It... Oh, Zach, it gets so much worse. <laughs> this character is the worst character ever. Can this guy please be the murderer? I want to send him to jail. <laughs> you know, on closer inspection... Oh. <laughs> Yeah. God, <laughs> no! No! Yeah. Yep. <laughs> now, can you can you give me the tongue sound that they do in JoJo for this? Oh, the. Chris in the chat says, here's a thought. Actually, fuck this. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <sighs> hey, did you do a lot of cosplay? Because that cost you rock sores. <laughs> rock sores? B -b what? <laughs> hey, you're drooling. Huh? Mm -hmm. LOL. Buffer overrun. God. Is this guy just cream his pants? <laughs> Fucking, I hate this guy. The reason why they only do from the waist up, Pridge. Yeah, yeah. You've triggered my creative powers. And that's not what. That's not what I would use to describe my boner. But okay. 
<laughs> You've triggered me in many other ways. Yes. Yes, it's coming to me. Pink Princess. <laughs> Jason says, how the hell do they make a character with every negative stereotype ever? <laughs> <laughs> The sequel to the Steel Samurai, Pink Princess, Warrior of Little Old Tokyo. Raffle LMAO. P Pink Princess. Why does it be Little Old Tokyo? You know what? Okay, good. I'm glad that they called that out. <laughs> uh huh. Why can't it have a cool name like Neo Old Tokyo? Maya, we really need to talk about cool. <laughs> Just look at me, Maya. I'm the coolest of the cool. <laughs> God, I really don't want to talk to this guy, but I'm <laughs> sure we have to. I'm sure we have to. Did you notice anything unusual on the day of the murder? Oh, I know how you dudes are. That security lady told you about us, huh? What is J-O-O? -O? I was around during leaked speak. That was not a thing that we you. used. It's just it's you. you. I, I know, well, I can't, I know that, but <laughs> I, I was around during leaked speak. No one used that. <laughs> no, no one really used leaked speak. That's the problem. I mean, some people did, truthfully, though. I mean, but only- no one used J-O-O -O instead of Y-O-U because they're the same length. <laughs> only, only the leaked hacksaws. Uh, he is a great lead hacksaw. Yeah. That's right. It was a pretty regular day. We had a run through for an action scene in the morning. Then a meeting from lunchtime in the studio to trader. <laughs> I was so busy I didn't even get a chance to eat lunch, frowny face. A T bone steak, was it? Yeah. Suck swords. I hate missing out on food. Uh... Nick, what does suck sores mean? <laughs> no idea. Anyway, I was in a meeting from noon until after four. With the producer and some bigwigs from the network. Mr. S Mr. Hammer's time of death was estimated at 2.30 p.m. If he's telling the truth, that meeting gives him an alibi. <sighs> About the producer who was at the meeting with you. Oh, you mean D. Vasquez? Is that a pun? Is that a pun? D. Vasquez. D. Vasque D. Vasquez? <laughs> uh, Dan says, I think it's a pun on Diva. D. Va D. Va D. Vasquez. Yeah, could, could work, could work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> He's named that because you'll catch Salmonella if you're within 10 feet of him. <laughs> <laughs> she brought these studio she brought these studios back from the brink of destruction. She's the one who made it possible for me to make the steel samurai. You had a meeting with her on the day of the murder, right? Yeah, we were together from noon to 4 p.m. the whole time. I don't know if anyone can tell. I just realized I'm basically doing uh, fucking what's his name from regular show. Oh, oh I'm doing muscle man, from regular muscle show. man. Yeah, yeah, you are doing. Your mom. Doing muscle <laughs> <man right> now. <laughs> <laughs> fucking yeah, your mom. It's <laughs> so good. Um, uh, all right. So actually, if you type in D Vasquez, like the third thing is D Vasquez pun. Because you're not the only one confused. Wow. Um. So I just this is just the first thing I found. One, it most likely all it mostly is diva. Hmm. Okay. But also the Vasquez rocks are a rock formation in California that has been used as a setting for various media, including the Power Rangers. Fuck, uh, that's good. Uh, so if there's a deep cut, the power if the Steel Samurai is a Power Rangers esque show, then that that esque show, and that mask is a thing. That's a actually potential deep cut. That's actually that's maybe a really, really cool. that's maybe the most clever name they've done so far. Then holy shit, <laughs> I love that. Damn. Yeah, that's really fucking cool. Thank uh, you very much for that up, Fridge. Yeah. 
Who exactly are these bigwigs people keep mentioning? Oh, the boss over at the network and some sponsors. Also a few production guys. They piled into a limousine and got here right around noon. Major tension. Were all of them with you the entire time? Yeah, unfortunately. They're all gray-haired geezers. Hmm, sounds like they'd all be reliable witnesses. Uh, I don't know if there's anything more to say to this guy. We could present... I don't know, let's just present the spear, see if it does anything. I try not to pay much attention to things that don't interest me, lol. It's the fucking weapon, it's the... <laughs> Why are you staring at me like God. that? God! You just made her cry! Let's get the God. fuck out of here. I'm done with this fucking man. <laughs> I hope we never have to see him again. I know we will, oh, but... Oh, you will. Yeah. God damn it. Ugh, that was hell. Oh shit! Oh god, they let you out of jail. Aha! You again! Ah! How rude! Acting like you've seen a ghost. Do you have squatter's rights, though? I would rather it been a ghost. <laughs> you certainly got back to your post quickly. Oh, took me away. They did. They pulled out a spare steel samurai costume. Told me to put it on. Can you imagine? How could I, a sweet little old lady, wear a giant suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. As soon as they saw there was no way I could wear it, they let me go. I guess that would rule out her being the murderer. Anyway. Good job, Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> Your powers of deduction are legendary. <laughs> anyway, know this, whippersnapper. This old lady never forgets the sight of it, a slight or an insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. Now I know you're. I know you're not the. I know we can't make you the murderer, but do they still let you out for committing perjury? That's a dang good point. When, when you admitted that the producer or director told you not to tell the <laughs> court you, they were there, and you yeah. did, which is lying and thus Listen. perjury. Listen, Miss Oldbag has a lot of money in stocks. She bailed herself out. <laughs> she, she was investing in GameStop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, no, back no. in the early 2000s when this came out, <laughs> she was doing pretty good. Sure. Talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. <laughs> Starting now. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this lady's too much. Um, about that kid you said you saw. If I should again, I'm taking him down. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna murder him. <laughs> she just pulls out a nine. <laughs> <laughs> she pulls out a spear. <laughs> This, hey, that's the murder weapon, and it's got blood on it. I'm, I'll do to him what I did to the Will Powers. <laughs> to Jack Hammer, I mean. <laughs> Nick, look at her eyes. She's serious. About the director, the one who was here on the day of the murder. If I see him, I'm taking him down. <laughs> she pulls out a second gun. Nick, she's losing it. Okay. <laughs> that was really good. I'm glad we did this. <laughs> uh, I do realize we haven't gone to the detention studio yet. We could do that. The detention studio. Uh, that's yes. Live from the detention studio. <laughs> hey, it's I mean, it's your host, Will Powers. <laughs> I got I. Yeah, I mean, I guess if there's something else he could tell us. But we'll see. I I, I can't imagine. If nothing, else, but... if nothing else, I can do my. <laughs> Terrible Hugh Jackman impression. <laughs> oh, Mr. Wright, thank you for earlier. Not at all. We got lucky to tell the truth. You can say that again. 
Let's we got not. lucky to tell the truth. You can <laughs> say that again. What? <laughs> so, WP, do you have any leads? Any leads that might get us going in the right direction? Mm. Sorry, but no. Be sure to tell us anything that comes to mind, no, ha no matter how small. We can't rely on getting lucky again tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> Do, uh, fanboys sneak into the studios often? No, not that I know of. Bit security light, he's pretty strict with them. But in today's testimony, didn't she say they were often hanging around? The kids really, really love the Steel Samurai. They sneak past when she's not looking, I guess. Was the director present at the morning run-through? Yes. Yes, he was. He was directing how the Steel Samurai and the evil magistrate should move. Why didn't you tell us that before? Well, just... The studio asked us to keep quiet. That has nothing to do with this. I hate to repeat myself, but Nick here is a newbie lawyer, fresh off the bar. <laughs> Thanks, Maya. When he loses, he's going to lose big. Ouch. Okay. What the fuck. <laughs> I, I see. <laughs> Whose side is she on? <laughs> you aren't hiding anything else from us, are you? No, I sure hope not. Boy, there he is. Something, something's gonna happen. There we go. There it is. Hey! Hey, wait! I bet he came in through that drain. <laughs> he just sidestepped five feet. Hey, uh, Kiddio, uh, what's your name? Sport? <laughs> Good, Maya's talking like a... Step, I guess, stepdad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a kid, so don't talk to me like that. It's a pretty good shonen protagonist. Huh? But you, you are a kid. What a rude little brat. There's no way to, that's no way to talk to an adult. 18. I don't see no adults here, hippie fashion chick. Again, I do love that they're like, how do we Americanize uh, her, her, Spirit medium clothes. Oh, she's a hippie. Hippie. <laughs> hippie fashion? Nick, I think I'm being mocked. You gotta hand it to Maya. She's pretty sharp and pretty mad. <laughs> I'm Cody. Cody Hackins. Call me kitty again, and I'll cut you down where you stand, evildoer. I love that he can't get the sword out of his katana. Is she... <laughs> So, you're a fan of the Steel Samurai? How dare you utter that name, evildoer! What do you mean? We're on the Steel Samurai side! Ha! Ha ha! You can't fool me! Okay... Then what's the last line said by the innkeeper in Episode 8? Ha! Easy! Like some fries with that? Not bad, Kitty-O. Watch it! What are they doing? <laughs> Thank you, Phoenix. <laughs> I thought exactly. This is how Phoenix Wright... This is how Phoenix Wright fans talk to each other. <laughs> That's fucking true. <laughs> Say, you heard anything about the incident the other day? <laughs> you were here, weren't you? <laughs> Did you see anything? He always, the Steel Samurai always wins. Always. Yeah, I saw him. I saw everything. What? But no way I'm telling you losers. <laughs> what? Wait. Let me go. Nick, you killed him. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. I, I didn't mean to. <laughs> He's gone. 
Huh. Something fell off the table when he bumped into it on his way out. A prescription pill bottle? <laughs> Why was this sitting here, I wonder? It says, topical cream, rub on affected area to remove <laughs> rash. I, really quick, what it, what it said there was, uh, bottle slipped into pocket. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what was that kid saying? He saw everything. Really quick, I'm going to look at this fucking empty bottle. Okay, yeah, sleeping pills. There we go. <laughs> Just making sure. Yeah. All right. Uh, someone gave someone gave Will Powers sleeping pills so that he'd have to go take a nap and would be unaccounted for during the murder. Hmm. Hmm. You're, playing, you're playing a dangerous game. Oh, fuck. I did not mean to go it. here. Ah, get away! <laughs> hey guys, what's going on? Nope. <laughs> you want to come hang out for a bit? Nope. <laughs> I can show you my Steel Samurai fan fiction that I wrote. No. <laughs> Where's that old windbag? Odd of her to leave her post. Hey! Nick, that was her! Stop! Whippersnapper! Suddenly, two gunshots <laughs> ring out through the air. <laughs> it, yeah, it sounds Just like, like she's... It was all over. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we've got a second job offer. <laughs> yeah, sounds like she's chasing after that boy. <laughs> Uh-oh, she tripped. She died. She broke her hip. She needs life alert. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll, wait, what's, what's the fucking throwback, if you can remember this commercial, the... All senior citizens should have, have a life alert. You yeah. know what? I hate it. I hate it because now uh, people who are watching live, maybe I'll just cut this part. But now I am envisioning me photoshopping the face of old bag over the woman in that commercial falling down. And you can hold me to it. The, the 14 of you who are watching, if this isn't in the final video, yell at me in the comments. But I, I, I'm hesitantly <laughs> committing to it. All senior citizens should have life alert. Maya sure looks happy. Maya does love watching old people suffer. <laughs> oh! This is it, Nick! The trailer key. The key, to that, the key to that trailer in Studio 2? He'll be borrowing this, right, Nick? Doesn't even have to answer. Hasn't stopped us before, Maya. And again, yeah, trailer key slipped into your pocket. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's open that damn door. Ha ha. I wonder if this key we borrowed from the guard station will work. I mean, it. That it, key we specifically borrowed to get in here. It fucking better work, goddamn. <laughs> Man, doesn't work. <laughs> it opens. I guess we should try something else. Great, let's go, Nick. She seems eager all of a sudden. I feel like she's been eager this whole time. <laughs> well, you first, Nick. Ah, not that eager. <laughs> <sighs> hey! Hey, there she is. Eek! Someone's in here. Oh, what voice are Yeah, I'm, I'm really curious how you're going to do this. Because I want to give her, like... All right. To all of you listening, I might change the, I might change the voice depending <laughs> on how I like what I'm about to do. Okay, okay. No so, pressure, no pressure. We're having fun. It's a good thing that she doesn't talk a lot. Yeah. Uh, okay. Names. <laughs> I got uh, chills. Names? <laughs> Thank you. That was, that was I powerful. Know, that was, yeah, I know, right? Um, we're... WP's lawyers and um I see a and who might you D Vasquez the producer D Vasquez she's quite beautiful <laughs> fucking phoenix <laughs> uh I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder 
Miss Vasquez? Great. Uh, excuse me? Script. I'm looking for a script. A script? The Steel Samurai episode 13. I need it. Um, could we ask you a bit about the day of the murder? I need to read it. <laughs> We're getting nowhere fast. <laughs> <laughs> Um, we'd really like to ask you about the Steel Samurai. Miss Vasquez? It's on TV. Every week. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that. <laughs> Nick, she's telling us to go watch TV! The nerve of her! Look, hey. I'm not saying this. I'm not saying this lady killed Jack Hammer, but she's killed someone in her life, <laughs> and they and they probably deserved it. <laughs> uh, really quick, Dan in the chat says, actually, out of curiosity, what charges would you use to indict Phoenix himself, and what are the possible sentences? Um, oof. Uh, that's a good there, question. I mean, there's a lot. There's a lot of charges related to tampering with evidence. Mm. Um. I mean, to us, so in in terms of within the court case, the evidence would just be thrown out, and it would there would mostly be a mistrial of some sort, and then he'd be then he'd be you know uh, punished professionally. You know, you can obviously get uh, censored or suspended or disbarred as a lawyer. Um, if they actually wanted to go as far as to like arrest him, it depends on what piece of evidence we're talking about. I mean, he does steal a lot of things, so that's theft he, mm. <laughs> he does break into he does break into some places he's not supposed to be so that's breaking and entering now Pridge, what's the sentence for borrowing thing <laughs> look if you have to use that kind of inflection on the word borrow i think you just mean steal <laughs> yeah <laughs> hey don't get mad at me uh about the director Sal Manella, was it? What uh, exactly is his role here? Director, he's Phoenix. He's yeah, the what the director. What director a fucking show. question. What the fuck? <laughs> Perhaps I didn't make myself clear. I'm looking for a script. Nick, are all people in the entertainment business this weird? Maya, yes. I can answer that question, yes. <laughs> Yes, they are. <laughs> oh, God. It's starting to look like it. Nick, let's get out of here. Isn't there someplace else we have to check? Y yeah. yeah. Is there? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Yes? If you see Manella, give him this. Oh, fuck, we have to go back to him. Why do we have to do your errands? I, I don't think I like her. <laughs> don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weakness. <laughs> All right, we'll give it to him if we see him. Unfortunately, I think we will. Really quick, though, I am going to read that personal letter she gave us. Bring me the script for episode 13. Okay, why did I expect anything different? Shocker. <laughs> <sighs> You know, I, was, I was hoping to, for some fucking evidence, but nope. Fuck, I Did went the really? wrong way. <laughs> Fuck. Oh boy, here we go. Everybody's favorite character. I fucking hate him. Here, I got this from the producer. Huh? Bring me the script for episode 13. Episode 13? Where did I put that one? I must have left it somewhere. Uh-oh. Uh My ass is burned if I don't find it. Man, how many years has it been since I've heard someone legitimately say pwned? That one. That one hurts Nick. a little. Yeah. <laughs> Nick. It might be quicker to just look in all the places where he's likely to have been. I don't want to go to those places. I don't think we can do that and show that on uh, <laughs> fucking YouTube. 
I agree. I mean, I guess we're going to 4chan, folks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys like to browse B2? God damn it, no, we can't say that. <laughs> there we go. There it is. We're back at the scene of the crime. Let's find what we need and get out of here quick, Nick. Oh, I wonder if it's that thing on the chair that looks like it could be a script. So in 14, you need 13? Hey, look! <laughs> That's the chair the director sits in. I've always wanted to sit in one of these. Ah, there's this annoying script here. Let's throw that away. The director? <laughs> Maya, take a look around that chair for me, would you? Again, we it's can see! Right there! <laughs> <laughs> Remember the script the director was talking about? Didn't he say he'd left it somewhere? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, found it, Nick. The script. Good work. <laughs> For you watching at home, do you see the script? Say script. Oh, say, oh, it's, it's just a little door the explorer to me. Present. <laughs> bottle. <laughs> Here, we found it. Your script. Uh. Script handed to the D Vasquez. Um, uh, you're not going to talk to us? Quiet. I'm reading. Just you hold on. What's the big idea? Who do you think you are, anyway? And, and, and do you even know who we are? Bowers is lawyers. Um, right. Maya, you introduced yourself as yeah, that. Yeah, we did say that we were <laughs> WP's lawyers. Am I a suspect? No, it's just, well, no, but... I feel like you could have lied on that one. You wanted to know about the day of the murder? Yes. Anything you could tell us would be a big help. You know there was a meeting here at noon. Yes, with the director and people from the network? Correct. Now, listen closely. None of the people in this trailer that afternoon went to Studio One. It was impossible for us to leave. Impossible? Why? The path was blocked. The path? Wait, what? Oh, okay. I was like, do I have to present evidence to prove her story? <laughs> <laughs> On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked? You saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? <laughs> I do appreciate that you're doing like this Eastern European voice and her just saying Mr. Monkey like it's nothing is like, uh -huh. you know, Mr. Monkey. <laughs> Mr. Monkey. Mr. Monkey. Uh, Mr. Monkey? <laughs> <laughs> the monkey with the broken head. Oh, right. That. A monkey. Uh, okay. Well, yeah, it looks like a monkey to me, you know. <laughs> Fucking... Thank you, Japan. His head fell over in the wind on the day of the murder. They Paper didn't mache? start moving. <laughs> they didn't start moving the head out of the way until around... Th until after three. It was after... F it was after four by the time the path was unblocked. Gabish. Oh, she's like Italian. Mm. Whatever, I'm gonna stick with it. I like it. Everyone in this trailer was stuck here until the path was cleared. Stuck in this trailer. Stuck until after four. Hammer died at 2.30. Thus, none of us could have gone to Studio One. What? It's true. A crane came just after three to move the head. We called some people in to clear the way. I'm sure they'd corroborate my story. But wait, what if the head fell over after 2.30? Then you could have gone to Studio One. 2.30? The time of death? Very well. 
come. Ooh, I like where this is going. <laughs> That's Mr. Mo. <laughs> when he wasn't broken, it announced the time in Ooks. I fucking, this is too much. <laughs> One Ook per hour. Ook, 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 Ook. Always with the Ooking. <laughs> It is a monkey, after all. Check its head. The clock inside stopped when it broke. What is what's... Stop clocks and stopping being such important <laughs> clues in this game. Listen, I'm pretty sure only one person wrote this game. And then afterward, <laughs> it got a lot more popular, so they hired a lot more writers. <laughs> the first it's writer really liked... Broken clocks being a major plot point. Uh, also, uh, also, Dan points out, literally none of us have heard of walking through some light shrubbery. <laughs> <laughs> My question is, if this thing was so heavy that a crane have to move it, was there a tornado? Yeah, like how strong would the wind realistically have to be to right. rip if, that if head off? If this is so heavy that, a, that it, it needs a crane to move, then it also is probably too heavy for like, an afternoon breeze to knock it over. Unless you're claiming again, there was a tornado here. <laughs> it was it was one of those American typhoons, Bridge. <laughs> those American typhoons that we always have here. Uh-huh. Hey, it stopped at 215. 2.15. That's right. Monkey. <laughs> this path was blocked from 2.15 till after four. Therefore, we are innocent. Mr. Hammer died in Studio One at 2.30. See? Goodbye. Oh, we got the Mr. Monkey. Mr. Monkey. <laughs> All right, from now on, we always have to say Mr. Monkey with that voice. What do we do, Nick? There isn't anyone besides W. Peak who could have killed Hammer. It's over. We're finished. It sure well, the optimism, Maya. <laughs> It sure doesn't look good. <laughs> Love guess, the optimism, Phoenix. Guess we should head back to the office and plan our strategy. We don't have anything. <laughs> we have if we nothing. Go office, if we go to the office, Maya will be sad because she's, she's had another murder scene. <laughs> Her fucking sister <laughs> died here. Nick, I don't want to be here. <laughs> There's just no pleasing you, is there, Faye? <laughs> now what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's yeah, did you think the best place to find them was back at the office? <laughs> Everyone's alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. Things are looking pretty grim. It's a little early for giving up, don't you think? Huh? You've got one lead. M Mia! <gasps> it's you! Boobs! What took Boobs. you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Or close to where my dead body was. <laughs> <laughs> my spirit is always here, Nick. I'm oh. haunting you. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, wait. I, I guess that means we're really in trouble. I'd say so. What did you mean? We have one lead. The boy, of course. Yeah, I saw. I saw everything. What? But but no way am I telling you, losers. I don't know. He, he didn't sound like he was going to help us at all. I mean, then, fucking. Then sub then subpoena his ass to court. <laughs> exactly. I'm sure you can find some way of bringing him over to your side. A gun. Like a subpoena. <laughs> oh, that too. <laughs> Either way, we should get back to the studios. Also, I like that we've just forgotten that Miss Old Bag like fucking fell and broke her hip. That boy is our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks. Now I'm more worried than I was before. <laughs> uh. Oh, we got more shit. Oh, here we go. <sighs> <sighs> What's wrong? 
We whippersnapper. She's been chasing that boy this whole time. When I, when I catch him, I. <laughs> Sounds like she hasn't had any luck catching him. Yeah, yeah, I, I got a hostage now, whippersnapper. Yes, again, not something you should probably yell. A hostage? Especially considering somebody was just murdered here a day ago. Uh, can uh, we ask what she means by hostage? Can we ask what she means by hostage? Uh, really quick. Uh, Medavis says, funny also that Maya doesn't remember when she is anything when she's possessed by Mia, but Bian knows literally everything that's happening while she was spiritually elsewhere. Also, Dan says, how does subpoenaing a child work? Is that any different than with adults? And that is a I good mean, question. you probably have you you probably have to deliver the subpoena to a guardian. Uh, yeah, that's that's probably fair. I mean, uh, again, yeah. I, if there's any more particulars, there there might be, but I mean, you probably oh, uh, you know, the police probably don't walk up to a kid and say, "Come to court." <laughs> you, you probably present the subpoena to a guardian. You're coming with us, kid. Walking, right. <laughs> Well, your joke was good. I mean, again, I'm sorry you, you, we stepped you, on it. You obviously can. I mean, obviously, kids can be witnesses. Obviously, there's credibility issues with being younger. Obviously, true, but true, kids true. can be a witness, so you you obviously can subpoena them. You just most likely deliver the document to their guardian. Fair. Uh, I mean, let's talk about that hostage. What's this about a hostage? Phoenix is like <laughs> another job. <laughs> 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 When that boy was running away, he dropped this and ran. He'll come back for this one. They always come crawling back <laughs> to old bag. It's kind of hard to understand her with all that huffing and buffing. <laughs> she's, so, she's going to die of a heart attack. Phoenix. That hostage might be what we need. Again, Mia, I totally forgot that you were still possessing Maya. <laughs> Kobe might talk to us if we give if we give him that. Good idea. Miss Old Bag, might I No! I'm catching that brat <clears throat> if it's the last thing I do! Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? A trade? Hmm. I wonder. I'll uh I'll give you a smooch. <laughs> Give her the badge, somebody says. <laughs> At least it's just gonna watch her die from fucking exhaustion. <laughs> uh, can I give her the samurai spear? Can I give her the Mr. Monk? <laughs> uh, I'm a, um, my Ooh, you think she wants her key back? Oh, yeah, that, that could be. Miss Old Bag, I'm borrowing this just so you know. Oh, okay. Uh, just, just be sure to give it back. <laughs> she's not as demanding when she's exhausted. Okay. Uh, uh, sorry, the key card? Could be that. I'm wondering if, if the sleeping pills or anything, maybe? Oh, no, it's the key card. It's a card. <laughs> to Studio One? Right. A card key to Studio One. I, I could visit poor Hammer. What the? She's delusional. He's dead. <laughs> I'd like to visit. <laughs> He died. This is kind of Ooh. fucked up, right? She wants to just pay her last respects. She wants to pay his I last would... respects to his to his resting his place. Not his, not his resting time. place, his dying place. We're gonna we're gonna go there, and she's just laying in the middle of his uh, like, like the out I the chalk feel outline. So close to hammer right now. <laughs> and she she commits seppuku on top of his own death place. Okay, now it's dark. Zach. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was his his fan and you his lover you don't have your own card Miss Old Bank Studio One isn't my turf <laughs> you'll let me borrow 
Far with them. If I give her the card key, then I won't be able to go to Studio One. I mean, yeah, I I we, 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 we give her the card key. Why don't you let her borrow it, Phoenix? I guess it can't hurt. Here you go, Miss Old Bag. Listen to me, Sonny. I don't like having debts to no whippersnapper. An old bag always pays her debts. <laughs> <laughs> you take this, and we're even. Deal? What's this? A Steel Samurai trading card? Sneaky kid dropped it. I figure it's pretty important to him, though. Thank you. I may have a use for this. This must be the hostage she was talking about. <sighs> I'm off. This is becoming quite the fetch quest. Uh, there she goes, <laughs> hobbling off towards the studio. Let's find this fucking kid and get the goddamn key piece I of information kid. we need. Yeah. Hey. Hey, you. Wait a sec. Phoenix, was that the boy? Yeah. His name's Cody Hackins. I think he ran into the dressing room. That poor son of a bitch. Hey, hey what's up, kid? Come no. hang out with you, old salmonella. La 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 Damn it! He's getting away! Hey, Fuck! <laughs> Maya, or Mia, trip him! Come back! There, Kick. he's back. What? He just came back? <laughs> How did she... Would you mind helping us out? Please? I'm Cody. <laughs> okay. Hello, Cody. I'm Mia, Mia Faye. I like that he was a jerk to Maya, but now that she's possessed by Mia, he's like, I'll play ball. Now that he's possessed by boobs. Yeah, now that she looks older and has bigger boobs, he's uh, all game. Yeah, this 12 year old nice child is into it. Mm hmm. Nice to meet you. Yo. <laughs> and I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? <laughs> Phoenix, you can take it from here. Even though he clearly can't, doesn't like because he only he's only interested in your boobs. I'm not so <laughs> sure I'm qualified. Uh, I Phoenix mean, I... says, looking down at his lack of boobs. <laughs> <laughs> Cody, this look familiar? Hey, my you are. You are, oh, no. huh? You are, you know, ultra rare. That card's really hard to get. Man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb. I'll give you this if you help me. It's my card! By offering me something I already own, you're in effect... ...issuing the very basis of our consumer society, namely the principle of fair trade. Man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb. Okay, you first-year college economics student little shitbag. What do they teach these kids in school these days? Quantum physics? I don't need that card. Huh? I got a double. Just keep it. It's yours. What? After I went through all that trouble? If you want to trade, find me a really rare car. This motherfucking fetch quest. Just get us to the next trial, please, <laughs> oh God. Oh, my God. This is very painful. Really rare? You mean there's something rarer than an ultra rare? And it's called really rare? That sounds less rare. <laughs> ultra rare premium cards are way rarer than plain ultra rare cards. <sighs> listen, Come on. Listen, kid, I've got a fucking first edition holographic Charizard. Take it. Kid, a man is man, going to go to jail for murder. <laughs> a man is going to go to jail for murder if you don't stop fucking around. I really hope we go to the courtroom and we present the card as evidence and the judge is like, Wow, that's a super ultra rare premium card. I'd kill for one of those. 
What if this whole murder was just someone was like, man, I'd kill for that card. Two hours later, someone's dead. <laughs> man, for a grown-up, you sure are dumb. Premium. Rare. Why do I feel like we're talking about steaks? Fucking, where's Maya? What? She didn't even jump on that. Maya's not doesn't here. Like snakes as much. I think I know where we have to go. Pe Penny is somewhere. Yeah. Penny has. That's what the that's what the chat's saying. I guess I guess Penny's here. All right. Oh hi. Hello. What brings you here? Oh well, I had to arrange some stuff. Um. Yes. The um girl with you. Doesn't she seem a little different? Some okay. So, actually notice. So canonically, we've established that she does look different to everyone else, okay? <laughs> Which like, again, makes the second case so weird that no one <laughs> said anything about it. Like, yeah, that the actual murder she, victim suddenly showed up at the, uh, the, the fences stand. <laughs> oh, she's wearing different clothes. Can't be the same person. <laughs> Like, is she even the same person as before? Uh, nope. She's the same as always. Same as always. Okay. <laughs> Whatever you say. Penny is officially the most uh, observant person in the Ace Attorney series. Yep. Oh, yeah. We love we love Penny. And she only comes back in a spinoff game that didn't get released in America. Oh, freaking rip. Have you seen that boy since then? Nope. You missed it, though. The security lady was chasing her out after that boy so fast, I thought she'd collapse. Of course, he got away in the end. Boy, was she bad. Actually, we saw them. How's the old windbag doing? She was squeezing donuts through her clenched fist back at the guard station. I feel like we can make a drinky game of, like, take a shot every time they say donuts. <laughs> Some people take their jobs a little too seriously. What does that even mean? She just said she was squeezing donuts, Phoenix. Are all those posters on the wall here of Hammer? Yes. It's really a terrible loss for the studios. But his popularity had been waning recently, right? That's true. Then again, after what happened... After, After what happened? The incident. <laughs> you, you mean you don't know about Hammer? Oh no. Was he canceled? No, what? <laughs> He's an anti vaxxer. <laughs> <laughs> Cancel culture got to him real bad. <laughs> I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> well, I guess well, I guess I'm gonna keep asking. Wait, now you have to tell me. I'm a lawyer. You legally have to tell me. <laughs> what happened with Hammer? He came in wearing a thin blue lied t-shirt. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> he got canceled after that. <laughs> Dan, I, Dan I, in the chat says one day he came in talking about the deep state and the cabal and it really started freaking us out. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm sorry. I'm probably not the one who should tell you. Uh-oh. Why do I get the feeling something's being covered up here? You can't press her harder? No. She's just <laughs> not the one who should tell you. Uh, I mean, ah. can we give her these cards? Does this do anything for you? <laughs> do anything about this? Hey, that's a Steel Samurai trading card. I collect those, actually. Thank fucking God. You're a nerd. I'm what? I'm one card away from a complete set. Do we conveniently have the card you need? A complete set? Yeah, a set of one of each card. Huh. <laughs> wait. Wait, 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 wait. That's it? That's the card I need? You don't know how long I've been looking for it. Uh... I don't care what kind of girl you might think I am. I need that card. Wow. <laughs> Please! I beg you, please trade with me. Trade with you? Yes, trade cards. Look, I'll even trade you an ultra rare premium card. Trade me a, huh? Yes, it's a good deal for your ultra rare. 
Please! Phoenix, can't you see she's desperate? But how desperate is she? <laughs> What's everyone getting so excited about? Now, why would he not trade here? I mean, come on. Seconds ago, the kid told you he needed an ultra rare premium, and she literally said, I'll give you this ultra rare yeah. premium. I mean, I'm almost what? tempted to not trade just to see her reaction, but uh, come on, we're running out of time here. Okay. Thanks. This is for you. I do appreciate that they made an additional sprite just for the card handing out motion. Yeah. Yahoo! Oh, that's you. Shit. <laughs> I saw the, the, the P and I was like, oh, it's Phoenix. Let's <laughs> <laughs> go. Yahoo! Yahoo! And there she goes. Doesn't doing good things like that make you feel great? Yeah, especially when they advance the plot. Yeah, it does. <laughs> See this card? Do you know what we had to go through to get this, you little shit? <laughs> yeah, so... Wait, that's it! That's the last Ultra Rare Premium card I need! Come on, give it to me, Serendipitous. please! You gotta give it to me! Wow, I've never seen him so eager. Right, okay, how about a trade? You're on! I'll give you a samurai spear and throw in an evil magistrate to boot. No, 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 not that kind of trade. I don't want cards, I want information. Huh? I want pictures, pictures of Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> get me, Parker, get me pictures of Spider-Man. Wow, that's a really fucking good, oh, shit, what's his get name? Get in here. Uh, J.K. Simmons. Or J.K. Jay Simmons. Jonah yeah. J.K. Simmons is literally the perfect... Uh, J. Jonah Jameson. Thank you. Uh, to the point that they actually cast him twice. That's that's how good he is. Huh? You sure? Fine by me. Gave Erp card to Cody. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Phoenix. Let's hear what he has to say. He knows something that could help us. We can have we can have him take the stand tomorrow. Oh, he's taking the fucking stand. Again, we we, we could have done I that without doing this trade play. bullshit. Yeah, <laughs> subpoenas do exist, right? Like that's not we're not making this up. You were here on the day of the incident, right? Yeah. Did you see anything unusual? Cody. Cody, he needs to know because he's fighting for justice. God damn it. Isn't that the Steel Samurai's motto? For great justice? Is it really his motto? Tell this kid we're trying to get the guy who plays his hero not thrown in jail. Yeah, it's is, literally, is that, it's, not it, even, it's not even a hard case to get like, him to yeah, want to like, help us. Yeah, kid, <laughs> you, you know the guy who plays your favorite superhero? Do you want him to go to jail on the show to get canceled? No? Okay, help me. <laughs> yeah, it's, fucking, it's one plus one, SpongeBob. You have to help us fight for great justice, too. I... I saw... I saw everything! Well, well. We might get some useful information out of him yet. That's what he said before! He hasn't said anything new yet! I, I mean, did we ask him about the Steel Samurai? Is that what we have to do? Yes. Like, what's... So... You like the Steel Samurai? He's so cool! I... I guess. You're judging him by his looks. You have to look at his actions, at his life. I'm being lectured on life by a grade schooler. You like him too, don't you? Uh, oh me? Yeah, I am... Um, I love the Steel Samurai. So, tell me what your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. Oh boy. Fighting skills. Yeah, that, that that seems like the right answer. Gotta think of something. I like it when he uh he vanquishes his foes. Yeah. Was Steel Samurai always wins. Always. <laughs> I am curious if we had said Will Power's acting. <laughs> uh, I think no matter what you say, he agrees, and okay. he finds uh, he finds some clever way of saying. Okay. Yeah, I like that too. Check this out. <laughs> It's my fan album. What the? 
It's all pictures of the Steel Samurai. I go to every live performance. Those stupid pl publicity stunts? Those stupid pl Why can't I say pub- I can't say it! Those stupid publicity stunts where they beat each other up in public? Okay, there we go. That was maybe the hardest word I've ever used. I always take a picture when the Steel Samurai lands the final blow. Wazam! So you're gonna tell me you, you took a picture the moment that <laughs> uh, Hammer was murdered? No. I got them all. I never missed one. A perfect collection. Check it out. My new digital camera. Wow, that's very impressive. The newest model, isn't it? The only model. You bet, lady. I just got it for my birthday. My album has a name. Wanna hear it? The Steel Samurai Path to Glory. And it's kind of wholesome. <laughs> Steel Samurai always wins. Always. Hey, if you want this, you can have it, lady. You're just gonna give us this? Really? Are you sure? It's like your most prized possession. Yeah, I took these with a digital camera. Oh, okay, you got me on that one. I got all the data at home, so I can always make another one. Jason says Cody is a simp. <laughs> yeah! Got him! Well, then, I'm happy to accept. Thank you. But I have a boyfriend, just so you know. Also, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> What's with people always giving stuff to Maya? What a life. All right, I, mean, I guess we'll ask him about it. Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? Sorry, what did you see on the day of the incident? I got here that day around two. I had to come in through the woods out back so that old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost, though. I was in there for maybe a half hour or so. Then I finally got to the studio. After that... What is it, Cody? The, the Steel Samurai killed the bad guy! He used his samurai spear, just like always. One shot, one kill. It happened so fast, I got scared. I went home after that. Uh, I see. It must have been hard for you. And you say those nice things, but it's so obvious you aren't speaking from the heart. God damn. Um, right. Mia? Yes? I think we can say for sure this means the Steel Samurai did it. True enough. And the director has an alibi, so it wasn't him. Indeed. So, the only person left who it could have been is Will Powers. I have to admit, it's kind of a shock. But if you put this boy on the witness stand, your client will be guilty for sure. Well, that's not calling, No, then. not really. I think that would be wise. Best to leave this one alone. Not so fast, pal! Hey, it's Gumfuck. <laughs> I heard everything. Ah, son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> this boy here's a key witness. God damn it, Gumshoe, you do such a shitty job 90% of the time in this one time. <laughs> and he's under police protection starting now. This one time, Gumshoe. <laughs> Come on, son. You got a rendezvous with me down at the precinct. Are you arresting him? Or... <laughs> No, I ain't going. Oh, ah! You just got fucking snatched. <laughs> that didn't go so well. We're back to zero leads. And now we have a serious handicap at court. What are we gonna do, Mia? Well, hmm. I really need to be going. Aw, oh, thanks. <laughs> Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. C come to the trial tomorrow, please. I need you there. 
Wow, I just stand on your own two feet there, Phoenix. <laughs> Phoenix, can I ask you something? Why did you become a lawyer? Do you really believe that Mr. Powers is innocent? Believe. Believe it! Of course he is. That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. I'll see you in court! <laughs> I'll see you in court! Great. Thanks, Mia. See you soon. Does the, the Mario like bloop, 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 bloop. <laughs> is she oh is she downsizes to uh Maya? <laughs> Stop Fucking stealing God. your sister's body and let me do my job. God. We did it! Finally, only took us two hours instead of our normal one and a half. That's going to be it for another episode of Ace Attorney with a Real Lawyer. Again, remember, if you watch this on our YouTube, you can also watch us do it live every Wednesday at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time on our Twitch channel, which there's a link to down below. Go and follow us there. Get notifications when we go live. Also, join our Discord because we post our weekly schedule there just in case we have some changes to our stream schedule. Uh, but again, this has been another episode of Ace Attorney with an actual lawyer. I plead the fifth. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Good night. Mm.